Hello Young Justice fans, this is Dark Superboy again with another video for you based on our favourite superhero series. Well, somewhat, as this video will be discussing the future of DC Universe streaming channel and whether or not it's going to be moved over into the HBO Max digital service. Let's begin. Let's mix it up. First things first, as usual, this is only speculative and I'm just submitting the evidence I see in front of me so far. Let's get the first stuff out of the way. HBO Max is obviously the newest live streaming channel to hit the American uh, digital service. It features a large amount of Warner Brother material and a large amount of the C superhero material. And that's obviously what has got a lot of fans thinking of whether or not they are going to absorb DC Universe into the channel. And I honestly think this is going to happen, not specifically in the next couple of months, but maybe by the end of the year for reasons I'm about to explain. Number one, they've already started absorbing some of the DC channels into the franchise, namely um, Stargirl, which was originally meant to be broadcast solely on the DC Universe channel has already been brought over to HBO Max in one way or another with them both DCU and HBO Max streaming them with DC Universe leading by a single day. Um, second, Doom Patrol, a original DC Universe show, it has already been purchased the second season to be streamed on HBO Max and is not longer being streamed on DC Universe when it comes out, or at least that's what's been announced. Third, the Harley Quinn franchise. Now, although there has been no confirmation that DC Universe has sold Harley Quinn to HBO Max, HBO Max has already announced that they are going to be doing a live action version of a Harley Quinn series. So it makes more sense if they have the live action version and they can add in the uh, Harley Quinn animated series. So that is a lot of DC Universe's already, like, so far three out of, what, six shows that they've created on their own has already been purchased and is going to be transferred over to HBO Max. Another key point is that, hey, DC Universe hasn't actually announced any new projects recently. Most of it is still stuff that was already announced last year, with the exception of Bizarro TV. Why they wouldn't do this if they are going to be continuously streaming it makes no sense. So therefore, it, I think they're just going to play out the last of the shows that they've got before going over. Any new productions will just simply go over to HBO be on Max. I have no problem with uh, HBO Max taking over DC Universe uh, because it means once they sorted out the whole legal stuff, similar to the Amazon Fire Sticks, once HBO Max goes worldwide, every show on there is going to receive a larger audience, which means a larger support, which means larger I, um, financial reasons for them to keep renewing the show. And that leads me to Young Justice. Now, Young Justice, although confirmed for season three, has also been cited in the list of HBO shows that are going to be shown as being as it's going to be shown on HBO Max. So that is a it is most likely once season four production is complete and announced, they'll move it over to HBO Max and the two will become one. As I've always said, this is a very potentially good thing because it means one, the rest of the world gets introduced to Young Justice and two, Young Justice receive a larger amount of support from the viewers. Uh, and that means uh, high ratings, higher financial support for renewed seasons and more seasons means more episodes and more fans, more stuff for the fans to enjoy. So am I sad that DC Universe might be ending it's kind of a yes and no answer. Yes, in the form it was a great streaming channel, uh, and obviously if it ends, there'll be a, a good loss. But no, because it's just been it's most likely being moved over to HBO Max, which means uh, everything everything on that show still lives, and if it has a greater chance of survival, which is what most fans want from their shows that they like to have it last as long as possible. 
But these are just my views. Please let me know what you think in the comment section below. Your support is everything. I've been Dark Super Boy. This has been a video on Young Justice and DC Universe. Please like, comment and subscribe. And as always, let hope burn bright. Goodbye.